OK, it's time for the next part of our discussion of archetypes. So far, we have had Lego blocks, old psychiatrists, old man wizards, heroes, dark heroes. But next, we have an archetype, and there is nothing dark about this one. I think it's often best represented by the Scarecrow from The Wizard of Oz. A comedic, loyal, funny character in lots of ways, kind of part of the heart and soul of that movie. He, of course, represents the sidekick. Batman has Robin. Dorothy had the straw man. Luke Skywalker has R2-D2. These guys have stuff in common, the sidekicks. First of all, they are often funny. Um, they, don't, they have a particular style of humour, which I'd struggle to, to kind of adequately define for you, but they are there. The hero can be deadly earnest and often has trouble being funny, but the sidekick gets to be funny. It can be physical comedy, which is a lot of what they do with R2-D2. Uh, it can be verbally funny, which they did in the old um, Batman TV show. The sidekick is also intensely loyal. The sidekick will stand by the hero, and this is um, common to sidekicks. And the hero, the sidekick, also needs saving in some sense. George Costanza here needs saving from himself and his own stupidity, but sidekicks invariably get themselves into trouble so that they need finding. So let's do a little bit of um, sidekick spotting. Who is the sidekick in the Shrek movies? I'm not going to tell you what the answer is, but I am going to point. Actually, there's kind of two sidekicks. And they get to be funny in a way that the hero, who I would argue is in fact a dark hero, doesn't get to be. Let's look at the, um, the Cars movies. And your sidekick is there, right to the hero's side, and he is funny, he is loyal, and to some extent he needs saving. Another classic sidekick we see sitting there right next to the hero, and you can see that bewildered look on his face. Um, Ron Weasley, again intensely loyal, very funny, much funnier than Harry ever gets to be, and terribly, terribly loyal. So, on the closing note for this, can you think of the sidekicks in your favourite stories? <laughs>